Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the White Oak, Pennsylvanian toy collector. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time, people. And today, we'll be reviewing Transformers Kingdoms, Core Class, Hot Rod. Before we look at Hot Rod himself, we're going to look at the packaging. Transformers Kingdoms tr tr Trilogy Autobot Hot Rod. All right, sorry if I, if I had a stuttering moment. <laughs> I guess, guess my uh, head is getting confused right now, huh? But yeah, this is Core Class Hot Rod. Some nice artwork of Hot Rod. And we got an product shot of good old Transformers Kingdoms Hot Rod and his vehicle mode which is very very G1 accurate that's all there is to say for the packaging let's look at the figure itself it rolls very well and now for a vehicle mode comparison here he is next to my original Hot Rod, and this is from Transformers Combiner Wars Hot Rod, which was a repaint of Decepticon Blackjack. But that's one comparison. Now we're going to transform him into his robot mode. Disconnect his laser sword of righteousness. We're going to disconnect the legs, like so. And these parts separate from the hood section. Fold down the arms, like so. Flip up this to form his chest, his backpack. Fold accordion this flat, so to form his first leg. Second first, just like the first accordion the hood section and there we got hot rod in his robot mode and he's got his spoiler blasters to so go pew pew bang bang pew pew bang bang and he does have posable arms which is nice you can get him in some good poses with this figure which i do love bend at the knee that's nice for this core class figure give him Rodimus, his laser sword, or hot rod, his laser sword, so he can go slash, slash, slice, slice, blast, blast. But now we're going to get down to comparison with the only other hot rod I own, which I'm going to transform him off camera. I'm very good with this Combiner Wars hot rod because I've had him for so many years along with Combiner Wars Blackjack. But here we got Combiner Wars Rodimus, or Hot Rod, next to his Kingdom self. Kingdom nails Hot Rod, hands down. Combiner Wars Hot Rod, okay, but it doesn't look like this good-looking, accurate Hot Rod that I love. And now for another comparison with another Season 3 bot. Here is Kingdom's Hot Rod with, of course, Transformers Siege Ultra Magnus. And he is smaller than Ultra Magnus. Yeah, why wouldn't I do that comparison? Because they both showed up in the animated movie. And that's all there is to say for comparison. You're probably wondering, where did I get this figure? Well, I got this figure off Amazon for fifth, for about 10 bucks. Is a Kingdom Class, Core Class, Hot Rod worth adding to your Transformers collection? Yes, if you want a good looking Hot Rod at Core Class size to go in your Season 3 shelf, pick this guy up. He is worth the money, and he looks just like Hot Rod from the animated movie, which I love. He is my number one 
favorite hot rod as of this year. And I would highly recommend you pick this guy up. He is worth the money. Especially if you can get him for 10 bucks. But this is all there is to say for this review. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out YouTube land.